Oh, I need to get up. It's my only day off. I have so much to do today. I need to see my mom. It's her only day off. It's my only day off. I always miss out on fun stuff. What's this? Do most attractive people smell the best? Do I smell good? Ooh, no. Okay. I feel gross. I got a shower, so much to do. All right, here we go. Oh, this room is a mess. I need to clean this house. Got a shower, okay, okay, shower time. I wonder if I can go see Alan soon. Oh, I don't even have time to go to the barber. Man, I have no time. All right, I'm clean. Now, I have to get ready, film a video for my weekly vlog. Okay, where to begin? I need to eat food. I mean, first I gotta clean this room. Who's messaging me? Don't they know I don't have any free time? Okay, I hear you. <sighs> no cottages, no beaches. I haven't seen my boyfriend and we live together. I need to visit my mom today. And it's her only day off. I can't do everything. <laughs> ah! Overwhelmed. This is how to not get overwhelmed. Yeah. I find that when I have only one day to do all the things that I need to do, I start spinning. I spend time with people, see my friends, see my family, get my hair cut. Do my nails, which I did, by the way. I start spinning out of control. My list, my list just keeps adding, 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 adding. Here's what to do. First thing, call someone you love. <laughs> he said, you can only do so much. You can only do what you can. So what's the next thing? Get out of the house. My second step is take the advice your loved one has given you and get out of the house, go for a walk. Breathe in the life. It just kind of put into perspective just how lucky I am. Third thing, count your blessings. Be thankful. I'm thankful that I have a day off, that I have time to plan, because remember, stop and pause and plan your activities. Okay, I'm gonna go get my hair cut on this day, called, book the appointment, that's out of the way, Whew, feel better. Getting out of the house, being thankful, listening to the advice, and being able to plan really starts to, whew, you just, you need to take a breath sometimes. I think it's really important to do something for yourself, something that you love. I got to go to this huge I Can Do It seminar. It was very empowering. Insert clip. I'm at the I Can Do It seminar in Toronto, and I'm so pumped to see Gabby Bernstein today. I got her book, and hopefully we can get her to sign it. What's going on now? I even got to see her. I am just on top of the world right now. And I am in a lineup, a very big one, to get her to sign my book. Oh my god, I'm gonna read her. Do what you love. We've seen this before. You gotta do what you love. Don't stay in bed. Get out of bed. Just hit play. Get out there. And when you do that, universe opens up to you. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses. Even if they're dried roses like these ones. Every moment counts. Be present, be thankful. I'm going to go to a baseball game tonight and see my friends. I love you. Subscribe below. Remember, it's a gosh darn secret.